There is a fresh update on Tesla Cybertruck as last night Elon Musk and Tesla brought Tesla Cybertruck to show in New York City as you know Elon Musk is going to be in Saturday Night Live tonight and also the Cybertruck drove through the city uh, streets of New York City and I think it's a better much better advertisement for Cybertruck than if Tesla spent billions of dollars like other car companies on advertising. In this report I'm going to show you all the Cybertruck videos and images from New York City as I could gather. Welcome back dear friends. This is Armin Harayan from TorqueNews.com. If you are here for the first time, please subscribe to our channel for daily Tesla and electric vehicle news and ring the bell so you don't miss my coverage and also give us thumbs up and share in social media if you found it helpful. So first of all, let me give you some details that Joey Klender has from Tesla. Rad is saying the Tesla Cybertruck has been spotted in a company showroom in the uh, meatpacking district of Manhattan, New York, ahead of CEO Elon Musk's appearance on Saturday Night Live tonight, this evening. The Cybertruck was spotted by our friends um, who took multiple pictures and videos of the electric pickup uh, truck from Tesla at the company showroom located on 860 Washington Street in Manhattan and also in the streets of New York City as many uh, onlookers were looking and wondering at the huge size of the Cybertruck. Stay with me please because in this report I'm going to share some very random thoughts about Cybertruck in New York City and um, what we learned from this like mirrors, the size, the advertising and uh, the Cybertruck in Europe and things like that. But first of all remember this address 860 Washington Street in Manhattan. This is where you can go until I think Sunday evening or Sunday afternoon to see the Cybertruck because it will be on display. Elon Musk confirmed that until Sunday the Cybertruck would be on display at the New York City showroom of Tesla and uh, one person Person named Owen Sparks tweeted uh, yesterday saying can't wait how long is the Cybertruck in New York City for Elon Musk tweeted saying until Sunday so since the Cybertruck's unveiling in November 2019 uh, this electric truck has been has made several public appearances friends if you know some have been planned like the Cybertruck's scheduled appearance at the Peterson Automotive Museum in Los Angeles in 2020. Um, if you haven't seen that, uh, look Peterson Auto Mu Automotive Museum Cybertruck Turk News and you will see we have an extensive video report from that. And so it was in 2020 and was a planned appearance. And most recently, if you remember the Tesla's Giga Texas construction site right outside of Austin, Texas, Elon Musk drove there and came and it, it was a nice uh, uh, kind of uh, uh, statement about Tesla Cybertruck. I covered that in detail and you can see that in our coverage as well. So the Cybertruck was brought to New York City ahead of Musk's highly anticipated appearance on SNL Saturday Night Live tonight, this evening. The CEO has been in New York since Monday, where he landed at New Jersey's uh, Tateboro Airport and presumably made his way into Manhattan just hours later, uh, says, um, Ilan, uh, says uh, Joey Klender in Tesla Radi. However, in typical Musk style, it wasn't a simple appearance and week in New York. It appears he coordinated an appearance for the Cybertruck also to visit the Big Apple ahead of his SNL hosting alongside uh, musician Miley Cyrus. And uh, one of the most heavily contested designs in the history of the automotive sector, the Cybertruck is composed of a stainless steel exoskeleton along with bulletproof glass and several other highly durable features that make it one of the most robust and strong vehicles available to the general public for purchase while the Cybertruck has been under slight revisions from Musk and other Tesla engineers he updated the, uh, the world on the modifications the company plans to make during a recent uh, uh, during a recent uh, uh, I'm sorry, episode of Joe Rogan experience 
podcast. Now, let me share some random thoughts about Cybertruck as you're seeing these images from New York, uh, um, from New York City. Uh, now, imagine Cybertruck driving in New York City streets on full self-driving or autopilot. I'm wondering how much work it is to add autopilot to a vehicle with different dimensions than the Model S, Model 3, and Model Y, and Model X uh, in that lineup. Uh, is there training required or do the neural nets just get it so uh, if you have any ideas on that please let me know in the comments section here's another thought the Cybertruck has surely grown on many people including on me from what I see from comments in social media after people see it in New York City streets how they are amazed and so on so has Cybertruck grown uh, on you did you like the Cybertruck from first sight when it was unveiled or it, it took time until the uh, car grew on you so another thought um, the aftermarket modifications for this truck will be insane uh, for sure going to be a hello Vartok modification some people say and Cybertruck is huge I wonder how longer after main production uh, they will manufacture European Union variants of the Tesla Cybertruck because this version of the Cybertruck some European people say will be way too big to drive or park around Europe. Uh, yes, European many European streets are smaller because the continent is an historical old continent. And uh, uh, so I think I will not be surprised if Tesla unveils a special European smaller version or variant of the Cybertruck. What are your thoughts on this, friends? Let me know in the comments section below. So here's another thing. In, uh, note that the Cybertruck here in New York City doesn't have side mirrors. But imagine if your side mirrors could be seen from inside the vehicle like from your dash what do you think about that however it is still a prototype the production version of the Cybertruck will have side mirrors because it is required by uh, state laws I guess um, and also uh, the Cybertruck somehow looks like a cargo plane Cybertruck's NYC images and social media popularity shows that right now Elon Musk is right not wanting to spend money on Tesla advertising just drive the Cybertruck in the New York City streets and do a Saturday Night Live segment or other show segments and it will have more impact than spending several millions of dollars on advertising. Imagine the effect of 10, 20 Cybertrucks uh, would drive cross country and uh, be seen in many other cities or even more if Tesla produces like uh, 20 to 30 Cybertruck prototypes and drives them in different parts of the United States. I think that will have a tremendous uh, effect. Um, now, while the Cybertruck will remain relatively identical to the vehicle Tesla rolled out onto the stage in Hawthorne, California in late 2019, the company did raise some concerns about the sheer size of the vehicle after a taping of Jay Leno's garage in 2020. Leno, a car enthusiast who has visited Musk in the past to talk about the original Tesla Roadster, wanted to take the all-electric Cybertruck into the boring company tunnel in Los Angeles during the episode. Um, a tight squeeze seemed to be one reason why Elon Musk was second guessing the size of the cyber uh, truck along with some concerns from potential buyers who feared that the vehicle wouldn't fit into a residential garage or making space. Therefore, Musk told Rogan on the podcast that Tesla had made the vehicle slightly smaller. Elon Musk, here's what he said. He said, that's pretty much what it, the Cybertruck, will look like with very small differences. You know, we adjusted the size a few percent, uh, like around 3% or smaller. You don't want it to be a couple of inches too big for the tunnel. The Cybertruck uh, is still slated to begin production later this year at Giga Texas. Elon Musk believes that if Tesla gets lucky, a few deliveries will happen before the end of 2021. However, the expect, um, he expects volume production to take place in 2022. I said 
he believes if Tesla gets lucky was a quote from him I personally don't believe in luck but believe in hard work I'm sure he does too uh, that it depends on hard work so friends um, after making an appearance last month in Giga Texas the Cybertruck is now on display at the Tesla store in the meatpacking district of New York um, photos shared Twitter by Stephen Brennan show the electric truck is roped off uh, but visitors can get an up close look at the cyber truck um, and if you are in the area and want to check it out the tesla store is located at 806 washington street according to tesla's website the store is open until 8 p.m eastern standard time tonight and uh, and then reopens saturday morning uh, i mean uh, open today already it's already opening at 11 a.m so let me know what your thoughts are on tesla cyber truck in new york city on the streets of nyc and what do you expect from tonight's uh, show what announcements do you think uh, saturday night live elon musk will say this is armin harian from torquenews.com by the way we're hiring tesla reporters if you are interested contact me please and uh, share in social media join our community subscribe to our channel and give us thumbs up please see you soon in our next report and i look forward to communicating with you in the comments section have a great day everyone